doing things slightly different today. And I am still speaking to the wonderful people of Bristol, but about the new hobbies and interests they've picked up due to self-isolation. With everything that's going on right now, uh, everyone's been told to work or self-isolate from home. Um, are there any hobbies or interests you've always wanted to do? Um, and now because you have all this time, you're able to do them. Um, um, yeah, I suppose so. Um, I, yesterday, over the weekend, I started um, growing a few vegetables, which I was, I've been wanting to do this summer. So I um, made a couple of raised beds and um, grew some lettuces and some chilies and stuff. So, yeah. I've got a little electric drum kit at home. So I've been doing that for like an hour a day, which has been like actually really nice because I haven't had the time. Like normally I don't have the time to do it because I'm always at uni and rushing around. So I think being forced to stay at home actually makes you like do some of your hobbies more. Yeah, well, I, I, I did want to do it anyway this year, but um, I guess being as self-sufficient as possible is probably a good idea in these times. Yeah, definitely. I'm actually cooking, which sounds really ridiculous because I'm a 27-year-old woman, should have been cooking more before. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm actually like getting out cookbooks and trying different recipes and doing a lot more just cooking and saving money that way and discovering new kind of things to eat and do. So that's exciting. Uh, and hopefully that can continue. Feels like retirement, really. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. Early, <laughs> early retirement, looking to the future. Doing what you want to do and that your worth is not measured by how productive you are during this time, which I think will be a good wake up call for society in general, because we tend to measure our own worth and others worth by how much they produce rather than, you know, just on a human level connecting. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Thank you, you too. Bye. Bye.